Pribadi yang Fidelin And I'm Alphys And welcome, welcome to Geeky Eyes. Eyes Hey Alphys, how far do you think we can see into the horizon? Hmm, I'm not too sure, there's so many buildings around us blocking our sight Why don't we go to somewhere else? Where shall we go? How about the beach? Okay, let's go! Let's go! While going to beach, let's discuss a little theory about how far we can see on the horizon for this, we need to know little theory about uh, Pythagoras theorem. By using right angle triangle, Pythagoras derived a formula called c square is equal to a square plus b square. In this formula, c is the hypotenuse, a and b are the two sides of a right angle triangle. Right angle triangle is nothing but a triangle which has uh, one corner 90 degrees. The opposite to the 90 degrees corner is called hypotenuse, that we call c in this uh, diagram. C is always longer than A or B. Let's see how it works. If you know any of the two sides of this triangle, you can calculate third one using this formula. Suppose A and B are uh, 2 and 3 respectively. So you can calculate C by using this one. If we substitute a and b values in this formula, you will get c is 3.6 that is longer than a and b. Now let's go to earth. Let's treat this circle as a earth and we need to calculate d in this diagram. If you treat this small part as a right angle triangle, in this right angle triangle, R plus H is the hypotenuse and uh, this D is uh, one side and R is another side. So you need to calculate D using this formula. Here H is the person height and D is the distance between horizon to the person's eye. If you substitute these values in Pythagoras theorem, let's see how it works. The average person's height is 1.75 meters. If you convert it into kilometers, you will get 0.00175 kilometers. We know the radius of the earth that is 6371 kilometers. So let's substitute all these values in this formula and calculate D. So if you substitute and uh, calculate all these things, you will get uh, D value as uh, 4.72 kilometers. That is uh, the average person can see on the horizon. I have prepared one more thing for you for easy calculating this one. So I have made one excel sheet formula. So if you put your height here so that you can get the distance how far you can see. Suppose uh, you are in the 10 meters height building. So you can see 11.29 kilometers. And also I will share these two documents in the cloud and put link in the description below so that you can download this too and also you can share your height in the comments so that i can reply to your comment how far you can see on the horizon okay we are finally at the beach and here you can see we have this gigantic blue globe which represents the earth you can see the laptop over there which will help us do our calculations and of course the telescope itself which we will use it to look at the horizon okay let's go and find people to look at the telescope together how far can you see into the horizon? in the horizon? Hmm. Sorry, I, don't know how I, I don't have an idea if it's kilometers <laughs> near. roughly how many kilometers? that's, that's what I'm telling you <laughs> I don't have an idea of what is one kilometer what can this arrive from here to the ship? 35 kilometers from our height which ship? Uh, no need ship, just the horizon. How far can we see? No, 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 but you said one kilometer is hmm. from here to where? Uh, around those ships, those first line. One kilometer? Around there. But to answer your first question, 20 kilometers. From uh, average human height is 1.7 meters, right? Uh -huh. Actually, right, the furthest we can see is not 20, but 4. Kilometers. 4? Yeah, 4 only. Yeah. Are you okay for a quick question? Yeah. Okay, how far do you think the horizon is? Uh, this is a mic, lah. Yeah. I'm sure not sure. <laughs> how far do you think it is, lah? Kilometers 
Oh, guys. <laughs> okay, I give you a hint. Okay, the ships that you see, the first line of ships, they are one kilometer away from us. So the horizon is the point where the earth goes down, and we can't see anymore, right? I don't, I'm not sure. A random wild guess. 1,000. 1,000 yeah, kilometers? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, the actual fact is, if you are a 1.7 height guy, right? Huh. And because what we're standing on right now is elevated, right? From the sea level. So we're actually around 7 meters from our eyes. 7 meters. So from 7 meters, the horizon is actually not 1,000, but it's 9 kilometers. So wow. from your eye to straight there, quite, it's 9 kilometers before it down. Yeah, quite short. Yeah, but then, short. you see those faded islands over there. That's actually uh, Batam, wow. Indonesia. Yeah, and do you know how far they are? Yeah. <laughs> 20. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, 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 exactly 20. Yeah, exactly 20. Yeah, 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 But how come we can see? Isn't the horizon only 9 kilometers? How can we see? Because it's like got a lot of mountains on it. Ah, uh, correct. Right. Yeah, you're right. Like, it looks like uh, Correct. So even though it's, uh, what do you call that? Uh, already over the 9 kilometers, right? Mm. But it's tall enough that we can see from here. Yeah. yeah. Thanks very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, sorry. Hi. It's okay if I ask you a quick question. Sure. Okay. Do you know what's the horizon? I do <laughs> Yeah, horizon. <laughs> Why what the is this? Uh no, I just this short documentary to educate people about how far you can actually see. Yeah, quite far la. Quite far la, I know la, but <laughs> <laughs> But how far do you can see in terms of kilometers? How far do you think you can see before the earth goes down and then you cannot see anymore? <laughs> Twenty kilometers. From here, right? Uh-huh. This is around seven meters above sea level, because yeah. the platform here is around six ki- six meters, uh-huh. and our eyes are like uh, added one more meter lah. So actually, it's seven meters, right? So by right, the horizon is not twenty kilometers, but it's actually nine kilometers. So it's nine kilometers before this one. But wait, your twenty kilometers, right? If you look at those islands over there, how far do you think they are? <laughs> Boom! Yes, you are right. But you know what island are those? Oh, Batam yeah, no, you guys, you guys are correct, right. it's actually Batam. <laughs> but they are 20 kilometers away, but the horizon is only 9 kilometers. So how come we can see them? Sorry? How can we see something that's 20 kilometers away? Because of reflection and law of physics. Would you like to elaborate a little bit more? <laughs> well, you see, uh, the light bounces off our way, that's why you see the inside. Oh. When we look up, right, the reflection, I mean, there will be reflection. Once there's reflection, we cannot see how far or what is. I mean, technically, right? Horizon is something is just there. You cannot really see something that is just there. When the island itself is very distinct, you can see the island from here. If you tell me to see the whole entire horizon, I don't know what you're trying to tell. I mean, I don't define horizon for me to see. Uh. I mean, unless it says horizon, then I can see horizon. Define horizon for you. Horizon is basically a point, right, where like you see straight and then you know you can't see anymore because the earth goes down, right? But basically, you can see that, right? Your best guess is because it's obviously higher law. It's elevated as well. That's why you can see up to 20. But horizon by right, right, is when you see so as far as you can, right, before it goes down. That's why you, you cannot see any more things here. Okay, if the huh? earth is flat, right? <laughs> if the earth is flat, then how come we cannot see everything? Huh? Why we cannot see everything? If the earth is flat, how come you cannot see everything? Because the earth is round, that's why I can't see London from here. Technically, if you look far enough, you can see London. Okay, would you like to look through our telescope we have over there? Would you like to see London from Singapore? I mean, I got so many viewing and blocking hell. This is not cheap, worth it. Uh, we got free viewing for you. Normally, you go high place, you have to pay one dollar or something. I know, I know. Yeah, we know, we know. We are, we are also doing the same back to you. Yeah. Okay, yeah, okay. Thanks for your time, guys. No okay, so we've concluded our findings. Alpheus, what do you learn from this whole experience? Learn that you can actually see Indonesia, the island of Batam, from East Coast Park. Um, any interesting takeaways? Not really. What about you? <laughs> I am quite surprised that most people that we approach were very approachable and most of them were pretty receptive about the things that we had to say and to teach them. Um, it was also very interesting seeing how Alpheus interacted with people and gave his knowledge about this topic and it was quite cool also to see how um, accurate some people's guesses were when it came to how far we could see the horizon in kilometers. Yeah, that was pretty interesting. 
We've come to the end of the video, now let's pass it to Prakash to conclude. Hey guys, hope you find this video interesting and you learned something from this video. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe to Big Eyes! Oh, would you guys be okay with us seeing a video footage? Okay, come on, come on. Okay, what? There's uh, some guy over there be doing your uh, Okay, la. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Alright. <laughs> okay, <na? laughs> okay, okay. Thanks a lot for your time, guys.